Take it away, Martin. Thanks, Andrew. Um, so as I said, I'm Martin from Inslee, and I'm here to show you how to launch an insurance product in six minutes. So when you have your timers all set, let's get going and click it. To be fair, to launch a product in just six minutes, you probably need to do a little bit of preparation beforehand. For example, you need something to support your business processes for reviewing risks, for rating, quoting, binding, all that stuff. So uh, a low-code platform such as Insley is a good option because uh, usually it lets you configure those processes how you need. So for the demo, we've set up an account for our fictional friends at Space Travel Agency. But as you can see, uh, the platform's empty, so there's no clients or policies yet. And uh, the other crucial thing that's missing is the product itself. Now, you can build and design an insurance product using very basic tools like Microsoft Excel, for example. And we've seen a lot of good underwriters do that. They combine submission forms, raters, uh, submission registries, and even document templates using mail merge from Excel. But the downside is it can take quite a lot of time. So uh, wouldn't it be great if there was a way to just copy an existing product and then start tweaking it to make it your own? And that's why today we would like to introduce to you the concept of Inslee Blueprint Library. This is a library of digital assets containing all the basic building blocks of an insurance product. Or to put it even more simply, you can just take a product template and start tweaking it. Uh, it's available to all the Insley platform subscribers, so our friends at Space Travel Agency can uh, copy the product link, go to their platform, just drop the link into uh, the slot there, save, and the product template is downloaded. Now, I said it includes all the basic things you need for a product, so submission forms for data capture, rating and underwriting guidelines, uh, basic workflows, uh, basic email templates, document template, templates, all the essentials. And then you can use the built-in tools to go and edit what you need. So let's take a look at those individual elements, starting with the uh, document example. We've got a travel insurance certificate here, which you can easily change to your branding, uh, change the dynamic parts, and then just upload a new version. Uh, let's say we're happy with that for now, and let's have a look at the questionnaire. Uh, so we've got a travel insurance questionnaire set up here. We've got some basic travel-related questions. But uh, let's say we wanted to change this a little bit, add something that's not there. Then all we need to do is go to the product editor, which is done in JSON, as you can see. And uh, let's say we wanted to add a field for luggage cover. We could just copy an element go to the right place in form, then uh, drop that element into place, give it the name. Uh, let's say it's a drop-down field with three options. So we put that in there. All good to go. And now when we save it, you can see there's a new field drop-down added. So the form is, let's say we're happy with it for now. Uh, what else do we need? So we need the rate. So um, uh, when we downloaded the blueprint, the rater is included there as well. Now we're going to switch to the Insley rating engine, which is a separate module where you can set up your rates. So it's got all the inputs and output parameters. It's got data tables for your rates. It's got underwriting rules. Um, it's also got calculation steps, which is very similar to Excel formulas. So if you know how to build a, a rater in Excel, you can use this tool as well. And what's also nice, you can download the entire thing into an Excel and make changes there if you're more comfortable with Excel. And later, upload it back. So for today's purposes, let's say we're happy with those main elements. Let's go ahead and publish the product. And now, to see how all those elements come together, let's run a test quote. So we're going to click Create Quote populate the form. So we're going to put in the insured details there. Job done. Very nice. Uh, maybe we want to add an additional traveler. Let's do that. 
then fill in a couple of other required fields. Let's save it. Uh, let's try the Raider next. Okay, that's working as well. We can tweak it later, but it's, it's operational. Uh, let's now transition the quote from in progress to accepted and then bound. So this is just a basic workflow that we've used here. Uh, as said, you can change the workflow. So if you've got something a bit more elaborate, then of course you can change the steps there. But to wrap up the process, let's create a policy document. Um, let's have a look how it, how it looks like. So as you can see, it follows the same template we used earlier. It's got all the dynamic fields in there. Just a simple example. And now let's send this by email to either the customer or to the broker, depending on, on your use case. So our blueprints uh, can contain also basic email templates that you can use, or you can, of course, change if you, if you like to. So that's now sent, rounding off our uh, successful trial run here today. So that was Insley and how to launch an insurance product in six minutes. So this time we did a travel insurance product. Maybe next time we'll try something more complex, like let's say a commercial package policy in 12 minutes. Um, but jokes aside, we hope that you got something out of this session. And uh, if you'd like to know more how Insley could help your business, feel free to get in touch through insley.com. Thanks very much.